how you doing Aquarius so this will be your who's coming towards you right now love reading so I have for my two cards I pulled out Aquarius I got breadcrumb and then I have freedom so Aquarius I feel like the person that's coming towards you this is somebody who may have been half I'm here half ass giving you giving into the situation put it like that I feel like this person never really made a complete effort to carry y'all relationship forward in the past. Some of y'all felt like y'all was the only person putting in this relationship and the other person was not. Or this could be vice versa. But I am seeing that after somebody realized that they have been breadcrumb in the recent past, I feel like that may, that may have forced you to go in another direction. Some of y'all felt like this person wasn't putting in the effort because they wanted to have their freedom. They wanted to explore their options and just be single. Some of y'all definitely could have been dealing with a player Aquarius, but I am seeing that this person that's coming towards you is somebody that may have breadcrumbed you in the past because they wanted to, you know, like I said, they wanted to have their freedom. They wanted to do what they wanted to do. Some of y'all got rid of them. Some of y'all, they may have completely split up the relationship, you know, themselves. Y'all take what resonates, but I am seeing that for the most part, Aquarius, most of y'all not hurt over this person anymore because we got the Ten of Swords reversed. Y'all definitely not hurt over this person anymore. You know, I felt like the situation was completely painful, and I just felt like during the time that this person has been gone with that freedom card, I just felt like you allow yourself to heal from this person. And now that you are over it, for the most part, I feel like then this person wants to come in and they want another opportunity with you. We got fire energy right here. We got Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and I'm seeing air, Libra, Aquarius. Or Gemini, but I am seeing that your person wants another opportunity with you, Aquarius. Some of y'all don't even feel the same way. You don't have the same, you know, passionate desire for this person like you used to. I feel like most of y'all could be like focusing on y'all money right now, and you you could be putting um love on the back burner for some of you guys. Maybe you're just not attracted to those type of people anymore. Whoever you was dealing with, maybe you you I'm hearing that some of y'all way of like y'all switched off y'all way of dating you know maybe the type of people that you was attracted to before you're not attracted to those type of people anymore because i just felt like some of y'all have been through a really painful situation once again to a point where it woke you up and realized what you really want when it comes into a relationship and y'all i feel like most y'all just want somebody that's solid somebody that already got their shit together when it comes to their stability you know and I feel like that's what you're looking for, somebody who is solid, somebody who's going to give you what you deserve, who's going to offer you something, you know, in a relationship. But I am seeing, once again, I feel like y'all definitely let this person go. Most of y'all just don't have the desire for this person. You don't feel the same way about this person anymore. You know, you're not giving this person your attention. Y'all got this person in their head about you, Aquarius. That's why they want to come in. They realize that since you wasn't budging, now they got to budge. You know, now they got to come towards you because they see that you're not, you're not coming towards them. Some of y'all could be really, really stubborn, but I am seeing that you let go of this person. And now you got this person in their head, Aquarius, with this nine of swords right here. You know, your person is definitely up late at night, stressed out about, I feel like they more stressed out about you being with somebody else, you know, because we got that four cups right here. Your person is like, they thinking about how they treated you in the past. And they're afraid of you giving your love to somebody else with that other cup right there. That's what they're really concerned about. They're concerned about you being with somebody else. They ain't concerned about whatever has happened between y'all. I feel like this is more of them, you know, being in their head about, you know, how they messed. I mean, not just how they messed up, but about you giving that cup to somebody else and leaving them in the past. That's the energy that I'm getting. They don't want you to leave them in the past. You know, but you moved on for the most part, Aquarius. Most of y'all definitely moved on from this person because the way they treated you. You know, you just felt like this person was not making you a priority in this relationship. And you felt like this person wanted to have their freedom. So I feel like that's what you did. You gave them that. You gave this person. You was fine. Basically, Aquarius, you was fine with walking away. This is for the Aquarius that was fine with walking away, even though it was painful. And you didn't want to walk away. It's like you was forced to walk away you know, and be put into a whole other direction. Why does person go out and do what they wanted to do? You see what I'm saying? It's like you gave this person the um 
an option. Like you get his person. What's the, what's the word? Ultimatum. You gave them the options of whether they're going to choose you or they're going to choose their freedom. And I feel like that's what you did. And then, and then they chose their freedom. So once you allow them to do what they want to do and you walked away and continue to focus on yourself and allow yourself to heal, I guess that's when they just been all up in their head about you because they realized you wasn't going to come chasing them. That's the energy that I'm getting also. Your person realized that you're not chasing them and now you got them worried about you being in a relationship with somebody else. Look, they they worried about you being free, not only breaking free from them, but I just felt like being free and you know, doing your own thing with whoever you want to do it with. This is, it could be an Aries, Aries or Aquarius. Some of y'all could be an Aries or Aquarius match. I am getting that energy for some of you guys. But some of y'all ain't even focused on, once again, then I say that y'all focus on y'all money. Some of y'all ain't even focused on a relationship. Some of y'all don't even want to be in a relationship right now. You just want to be free. You just want to have some space. Some of y'all, like I said, y'all probably not even like, Y'all don't even want to date right now, Aquarius. Some of y'all just want to focus on y'all money, and that's it. You know, you could be just giving love a break right now, putting love on a back burner right now. But I just felt like, like I said, y'all y'all just doing y'all own thing. And some of y'all just don't want this person no more. But that Queen of Wands reverse and the Hierophant reverse, I'm clearly seeing now whoever I'm speaking to, you have already healed from this person. And you don't feel the same way about this person no more. You don't even look at this person as commitment material. You know, some of y'all feel like this person is the HOE. You, got, you feel like they for the streets, basically. Now you got this person all in their head because they feel like you're going to be with somebody else. And now they're stuck on... You know what you got going on and who you got going on with got going on with meanwhile you're not even thinking about a relationship aquarius you yeah you got your freedom yeah yeah you may be doing your own thing but you're not like looking for a commitment right now you don't even see this like i said you don't even see this person as commitment material death reverse but your person feel like it's not over your person don't want it's crazy because your it's like you let go but y'all, I feel like your person didn't change though. They're not looking for yup. This person is not looking for no long term commitment because we got the ten of pentacles and it's reversed. That's exactly what I'm seeing. Your person is not looking for anything long term, but they're gonna come in anyways with this ace of cups. Then I say that a new, they want a new a solid off. They want to bring you a new solid offer, and they want to start over in love, but. I don't know, Aquarius. I'm not seeing. We're going to see. Because I really. Some of y'all, this could be a new love. Some of y'all do got new love approaching y'all, Aquarius. Y'all do got new love. So y'all keep a lookout for for that. Even though some, most of y'all don't even want love right now. Whether you want it or not, it's coming. You know, but. I feel like y'all going to end up shutting people down. Y'all not taking. It's like y'all not settling for less anymore, Aquarius. You know your worth. You know what you deserve. You're not settling for less anymore. We got the Empress reversed. Some of y'all be careful because if this is the same person right here that, that, that came back, that breadcrumb you in the past, Aquarius, this person could be wanting to come back because they're doing bad right now in their life. But like I said, your person didn't change. We got cards really showing that this person is still the HOE. They still haven't changed with the death card reversed. The Empress reversed. This person has not grown up. It's clearly showing that this person is not even ready for a solid commitment. You already know that. That's why you know you know, you know you're not you don't really care about this person no more because you know what they're about. But like I say, your person only wants to come in if this is the old person. If they only want to come in and start over, is because they things ain't going things ain't looking fruitful in their life with this Empress Reverse card. Things are not progressing in their life. You know, I'm hearing that everything they plant it dies. Like completely, Every, whatever they try to get together in their life, Aquarius, I feel like it just completely like crash. It burned. It crashed and burned. Five of Pentacles. Look, this person ain't got no money. They broke. Some of y'all, this person ain't got nowhere to go. You know, they don't want you to leave them. I'm hearing they don't want you to win without them, Aquarius. Justice. Because they know if you leave them, this will be their bad karma. You see what I'm saying? They know this is their karma. For them leaving you because that's how you feel i don't know why i'm getting this reversal energy where this is how they made you feel everything that they did to you aquarius i'm is looking like it's happening to them 
with this Ten of Pentacles right here, with this Five of Pentacles. I mean, Ten of Pentacles reversed, and then we got Five of Pentacles reversed. Then we got the Empress reversed. This is their karma. That's why the Justice card is next to the Five of Pentacles. You know, the way they left you is, is happening to them. They know this is their karma. They don't want you to win. They don't want you to win. We got the Knight of Pentacles reversed. Yeah, they're not even offering you anything solid. This is just to get what they want and get the and get the crap out of there. You know, get up out of there. But they, some of y'all, like I said, they dragging their feet right now. They're procrastinating on coming towards you. But it's because they they know they can't offer you nothing because they're in a mix of karma right now. Some of y'all, this person is dragging their feet because they're still entertaining somebody else and they're trying to triangulate you, which is their baby mama or their baby dad. You see what I'm saying? But, and another thing is they want to, they want to drain you for your finances. They want to drain you for your energy. All they want to do is take from you. I'm hearing take away your energy, take away your happiness with this Knight of Pentacles reverse in the sun. This is somebody who, that's what they want. They want to drain you for your happiness. They want to triangulate you. They want to stress you out all over again. Basically, we got the Six of Swords reverse under it so yeah most of y'all are definitely i mean i said reverse six of swords most of y'all definitely moving away from this person some of y'all got two kids with this person um or they got two kids by somebody else i'm also hearing five somebody can have five children but i just feel like y'all could be moving on like literally some of y'all definitely trying to like purposely get away from this person i am clearly getting that energy also like you packed your stuff and you left some of y'all actually moved house and left some of y'all actually moved out of town and left, or you could be planning on doing all of this. This is for some of you guys, but I am seeing that. It's like you're trying to get away from this person. Most of y'all trying to purposely get away from this person. You don't want to be around this person. You don't want nothing to do with this person. You don't see this person as marriage material or commitment material, but they still going to try to, they're going to try their luck to come through. And I feel like most of y'all know what they want, and that's probably why you're trying to get away from this person, Aquarius. You know, this person is just trying to breadcrumb you all over again, basically. Them two cards right there, that's basically saying what they're trying to do. Because it's saying that in the spread, that that's what they're really trying to do. They're trying to really breadcrumb you. But it's crazy because I feel bad because I feel like even though you make this person happy, Aquarius, I just feel like your person is just not ready to change. That's the energy that I'm really getting. Like, they see you as somebody that... You know, they can have something solid with and that they could fall in love with with this Ace of Pentacles and this Ace of Cups. I'm seeing potential for love and commitment, like something solid, like something real, something solid between y'all. Because they know they're capable of having that with you, Aquarius, but they just don't want to change. They're just not commitment material. They want to be a HOE, run around, do their own thing, get what they need and get up out of there. You know, it's like they're there for a short period of time and then they, they ain't going to off with somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Your person, the only reason why they want to come through because they don't want to see nobody else. They don't want to witness somebody else of getting that um happiness with you because they know what you bring to the table. That's the energy that I'm getting. They don't want nobody else to steal what it is that you have done for them in the past. You know, and they know that they're in the karma right now. And... That's why they're taking so long to come towards you, even though they are. But I feel like another reason why is because they're still talking to somebody else, which could be a Leo. Isolation. Some of y'all trying, I'm telling y'all, some of y'all are trying to get away from this person. Y'all could be trying, y'all don't want to be seen. Y'all don't want to hear this person's voice. Hidden emotions. Wow, they hiding their feelings from you. Aquarius, did not say that y'all have the potential to have something solid, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, but they don't want to change. It's something wrong with them. They don't want to change. They rather hide the feelings that they have for you, Aquarius, and, and, and like not commit to you. It's crazy because I feel like y'all could like actually belong together in a sense, but your person is just something wrong with your person. What is it? Your person is confused. Dazed and confused. Your person is confused. They don't know what they want. You know, I feel like this is somebody who's emotionally unstable. Put it like that, Aquarius. Yeah, you're not you're not chasing this person. We got chaser, but it's reversed. You're not chasing them. You're not chasing them. They're not using their um intuition. We got signs from nature. And then we got divine masculine. Didn't y'all say this is somebody that you have the potential to actually have something solid with? This is actually your divine masculine, but you just 
probably not the meant to be with this person right now. Maybe in a long haul if they change, but for some reason, your person is just don't want to change. They know that they love you. They know that they can have something solid with you. I'm telling you, the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups right here, upright, both of them. And that is a good sign. But they're not done being, it's like your person is not done being a kid, basically. Look, they, they got some some healing to do. We got healing old wounds. That's why they can't come in. Because they still stuck on. They got some trauma. Put it like that. That's the energy that I'm really getting. Your person has a lot of trauma, Aquarius. And that's why they can't commit to you. You know, they still stuck on some past, situ past situation in their life. You know, it's like they do want the love. They see it right there in front of them. But it's like the past. Their past is holding them back. You know, whether that's a love interest that they may they could be dealing with right now or it could just be some trauma from their past whether that was from their childhood or some, another love interest that may have broken their heart before you but it's like yeah some of y'all just definitely don't want to commit to this person or they just probably not coming towards you yet but they are though you know what i'm saying it's like they want to come towards you i'm getting this energy that they they're gonna come towards you but you you could be the only one holding back yeah, somebody's not, you. they didn't give you no closure. Some of y'all's person ghosted you. Look, and they know they owe you an apology, Aquarius. Your person know they owe you an apology, Aquarius. You know, and it's, it's sad. It really is sad because I just feel like for some reason, your person, like this is your person. This is somebody you're supposed to be with, but they got a lot of trauma. You see what I'm saying? They still stuck on their path. But I'm going to go ahead and end it here, Aquarius. I hope at least a few messages resonate with you guys. And don't forget to like, comment down below, share, subscribe. And this is what I have. Y'all be blessed.